hey y'all it's your girl brie and welcome back to another youtube video what's popping what's good so today i have a story time welcome to story time sundays y'all clap it up clap it up welcome to story time sundays my life is a mess so i have stories for y'all and i want to share them and see if anyone else has had the similar experiences um this is y'all know by the title of this video i almost got robbed in the club I have friends, I do, but sometimes I question my friendship sometimes because ain't nobody helped me, okay? Nobody helped me, but we will get into that. Let's get right into it. Make sure you subscribe, like, comment, share, do all of that. And uh, yeah, let's just hop right into the video. What was this? What was me doing this? Not me doing this. What is this supposed to do? Why am I shooting y'all up? Y'all gonna see me get ready. I'm gonna tell a story and that's the set on that. If you don't like it. That's too damn bad! So, it is my best friend Joyce's birthday. I believe, yeah, it's her 21st birthday. So this is three years ago, y'all. Dumbass, no it wasn't. It was four years ago, 2016. I'm so dumb. She said, hey girl, like, we are i have um passes to go to this nightclub and i'm like oh bet oh bet and she's like yeah so you know if you want to bring anybody you can and i brought my friend aaron so i told aaron he was like yeah i'm done to go whatever whatever passes whatever cool so i'm like okay bet we're celebrating my girl's 21st so I go in there and we take pictures. We're taking pictures and being all cute. And you know, everything is a good time. First off, we got there. It was dead. The club was dead. Everything was dead. Nobody was, you know, trying to live their best life and get lit. I don't know if it's because we got there early or what, but we got there. It was, it was kind of dead. So we got there, we took pictures. And we started having, you know, doing our own thing. This was not 2017. Oh my God, I feel old. No, this is 2016, wasn't it? And, and do the math! 2016. Oh my God, the math, the math. It's the math for me. They probably pre-gamed. I did not pre-game. So um, we get there, they're getting drinks and stuff like that. I'm like, okay, cool, live your best life. Um, me and Aaron were doing our thing, you know, and it was cool, like very happy that it's my girl's birthday. It's summertime, so I'm thinking, how is it dead in the summer? Like, we need to get lit up, you know what I'm saying? But nonetheless, our group, we know how to party, okay? We know how to party, we know how to get lit we're having a good time you know no issues no problems people started to come in it started getting a little lit so you know girls we gotta stick together okay we can't just be running around doing whatever we want to do okay you gotta we gotta stick together people is crazy out here i always carry a bag i don't care what we're doing where we're going i always carry something so i always have a crossbody bag i don't have it with me right now but a crossbody bag it was kind of like this literally black just like this it has a zipper like this this one has two zippers this one had a flap so i could like open it and then you know a zipper to go inside of that was my go-to bag because everything that I needed in there fit in there. Wallet, keys, phone, boom, chapstick, and headphones. That's it. That's all I ever carry. At the time, well, one, I have no money. <laughs> no money. Oh, my God. <laughs> Bank roll. No money on my car. I also had my lanyard with my keys on it. And I had my lanyard around my neck, like any other regular person. That's what I was wearing. I forget what else I was wearing. In fact, I'll show y'all the outfit I was wearing because I think I still got it up on um, my Instagram. This guy comes up to me. 
I'm like, oh, hey, hi. And he goes, yeah, like I wanna dance with you. Now let me set the vibe of the club also, okay? Music that we wanna hear is 2015, 2016 vibes, okay? That's what we wanna hear. The DJ was out here playing stuff from the 2000s. Now, as much as I love me some 2000s music, we at the club, okay? I would like to hear something a little bit more current. Like, I don't feel like listening to that. I'm sorry. I love me some Aaliyah. In fact, yeah, I love me some Aaliyah. I love me some TLC. I love me some Chameleon Air. I love me some Chingy. Yes, I remembered who they played. But let's be very clear. I don't want to hear that right now. I don't. And then the songs were songs that you would chill to, like vibe to at home. You're not going to be dancing with nobody. Oh. oh my gosh. Ain't nobody trying to listen to that right now. <laughs> and he wants to dance with me to songs that don't, it don't, it, like, I'm not, like, why? Why do you want to dance with me during this song? I have a problem with saying no. That is, that was my issue at the time. Now I don't care. If I don't want to dance with you, I'm not gonna dance with you. Like, sorry, no, I'm not in the mood. Oh, I don't want to be a Debbie Downer and be one of those girls that just sits there in the corner and doesn't dance with nobody. Like, I'm not her. I'm sorry, I'm not her. If he wanted to dance with me, I'm sitting here like, why? This is not a song you dance to. And this should have been, this should have been a sign. Right then and there, I should not be dancing with him because who dances to this song? In fact, I know exactly what song it was. It was damn Fenito. Chief Key Fenito. I'll just sit a stain, Fenito. Fenito. Hey, 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 funny dummy. Who is dancing to that? Like, who is throwing it back to Fenito? Me being nice, I'm like, you know what? Let me just not be one of those girls. That says no. I I will dance with him, okay? Let me be nice. I will dance with him. Mind you, everyone was lit. No one is paying attention to what I'm doing, but I'm thinking, well, I'm with the group, so I'm fine, okay? I'm like, I'm not gonna even gonna dance with him for that long. I'm probably gonna dance with him for like 30 seconds, right? And usually DJs, like play the song for like 30 seconds and then like move on to a different song, right? That's what regular DJs do. And he was doing that all night until Finito came on. Hold on, wait a damn, wait a damn minute. You're playing the whole song of Finito? Why? You don't, we don't need to do that, why? And I'm like, you know what, I'm, I'm just gonna get off of him in like 30 seconds. I really don't care, like I'll just get off. When I'm finished, when I'm finished dancing with him, He's, I'm gonna try to get off. And he says, no, no, I wanna, I want some more. <laughs> I'm not gonna flatter myself. I know I could throw it back, but like, <laughs> can we calm down? It's really not that deep. I want, I want some more. In my head, I'm like, you got what you wanted. It's finito. What more do you want on finito? I'm contemplating. I'm like, do I dance with him some more? I'm like, you know what? Let me just take one for the team again and keep dancing. He seems like one of those annoying kind of niggas that be like, if I'm not gonna get you, I'm gonna get your friend. And honestly, the people that I was with, let me tell you something. My friend Joyce was taken at the time, so that's not happening. Um, The other people I was with, uh-uh, no. Like, you're definitely not gonna get with Aaron. Like, that's not happening. And you're not getting with any of the other people that we came with. You're just not, you're just not. So I'm like, this is what I mean by say, I'm gonna take one for the team. So again, I dance with him. We're gonna go back to this crossbody, okay? I will show y'all what the crossbody looks like because I did this um, story on Snapchat too a long, long, long time ago. You have to lift this up just to get some change and then unzip it all the way to get inside. I feel pressure on my right shoulder. 
I said, why am I feeling pressure on my right shoulder? Like there's nothing, I'm not like, why is there weight? No one's pushing down on me. He's not, he doesn't have his, you know how like men like grab you, like none of that was happening. So I'm like, why am I feeling this pressure on my right shoulder? Something don't feel right. And I looked down at my bag because I was like, there's no way. And this man, <laughs> this man is trying to get in my bag while I'm dancing with him. Are you Ed? Oh, yo, are you Ed? Like so now I'm like, oh my God, I've never been in this situation before. I've never been in this situation before until today. Like I said, I'm with the group. I looked at Aaron and I'm like, in my, I'm like, help me, help me. Like my face is like this. Did he help me? No. I'm like. No one, no one helps me. I'm like, yo, what the hell is going on? Why is no one helping me? And all those two do is just point at me and they're like hyping me up because I'm dancing with this guy. No, I need help. So now I'm like, what do I do? Do I, what do I do? So I'm like, okay, I don't want to make a scene because I'm not in the mood to make a scene. I made a scene one time in my last, uh, one of my old story times, I choked somebody out. I don't have time for that. I don't want to do that again. Then I look over to my right. His man's is standing right next to us. So now I'm like, oh my God, they're going to tag team me. They're going to tag team me. They're going to try and like get me. None of my friends are paying attention. I'm like, they're going to tag team me. I'm in a situation. He can't get in this bag. He's clearly having a hard time. If I feel pressure on my, on myself, I clearly am, he's not, having his way so I'm like maybe I can just leave this time I'm like okay this nigga uses my bag I'm oh he uses my strap on my bag to pull me back and he says where are you going boy if you don't I'm trying to get away are you my father are you my principal are you my boss are you my best friend what do you mean, where am I going? You don't have the right to ask. <laughs> Not at all. This man is tugging, tugging on my purse. And his man is just watching, looking and staring. I'm like, oh my God, what do I do? At this moment in time, I really had to finesse. And I was like, uh, 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 sir, no, I'm done dancing with you. I want to be with my friends now. You have had long enough. You've had long enough. You had the whole song of Fanito by Chief Keith. I said, we're done. I don't want to do it. I'm done. And then I look at his little friend. I said, and you're done too. Don't even try to ask me for a dance. I'm not. No, I don't be homie hopping like that. No, that's a dub. I go and tell my friends. I said, y'all didn't help me. Y'all saw my face. I'm out here. I don't know what to do. I said, I don't know what to do. And y'all sitting here hyping it up. They said, oh, we didn't know what was going on. We thought you were just having a good time. My facial, my facial expressions did not show um, a face of despair, a face of, 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 <laughs> help, of, 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 what is, I don't even know of. That you, um, you had, you, you, you could, you do. I'm confused. What do you mean you didn't know? Because there's no way that you see my face and I'm going like this and you don't know the code. How y'all not know the code? Y'all don't know the universal code of help me, the help me face. That's what I call it, the help me face. The get your ass over here face. The I get this nigga off me face. I know the face. Comment down below, do you know the face when someone's like this? Does What does that mean to y'all? Comment down below and tell me what that means to y'all. So he didn't make out with me. He ain't get shit from me. But I know who he did get shit from. 
Because the end of the night, it was done. The night was finished. And this girl was yelling, Ain't nobody leaving this club. Ain't nobody leaving this club because there's six iPhones missing. Six? <laughs> six? Oh, they made out tonight. That's why y'all got to pay attention. My lifeguard skills came in clutch that night because I'm telling you right now, they was not getting nothing from me. And even if they did try to get something from me, they was shit out of luck. And he was struggling trying to get into that damn bag. I need that damn bag back. In fact, that is my official going out bag because there is no way you're going to try to get me. And this is not the first time someone tried to rob me with that bag on. Because I remember in the same city, different club, same city, same bag, someone tried to get me there too. I don't understand. Do you think I'm stupid? The first time I was nice about it, I said, um, can you just not do that? Like, you, you're, you're not going to work. I literally said, this is not working for you. Can you not do that? And then he stopped and was like, oh, okay. And gave it back. At least he was nice. In fact, he didn't even take nothing. He didn't even take nothing. I was like, can you just not do that? You're not going to get anything from me. Hmm. Sorry, you're not getting anything from me. And what she said, ain't nobody leaving the club. He made out with six iPhones. She said, ain't nobody leaving the club until we get our phones back. There must be somebody named nobody because this, you're not talking to me. I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm gone. And that is the story of how I almost got robbed. Let me know what other stories you want to hear. I think I already know what other story y'all want to hear, but let me know in the comments down below if y'all want to hear any more stories. I got tons of them. My life is, my life is interesting, uh, to say the least. So subscribe, comment, like, share, do all that. And yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.